Hello students, today we are going to learn a new trick squaring any numbers. Square of any two digit numbers. Let us say take some numbers where unit place is 5. 25 square, 45 square, 85 square. So we will say this is our trick 1. Let us see how it works. First step 1 for this take a square of first unit place number is 5. 5 square is 25. This everybody knows right. Now go to the next number and see that that digit next number. 2 next number digit is 3. Then multiply these two numbers. 2 into 3 is 6. This is our answer. So, take a next example. 5 square is 25. Then 4 next number is 5. 5 4 is 20. This is our answer. Isn't it easy? You can do it within 2 seconds. 5 square is 25. And 8 next number is 9. Then 8 into 9 is 72. This is our square. So, you can take... Any numbers where the unit place is 5, you can use this trick. You can get the square within a second. Now, you will say the number can be any digit in the unit place. Yes. Let us see how can we do if our number is any number at unit place. Now, we will take that as a trick 2. Let us take an example. 27 square. First step here is write square of both the numbers. 7 square is 49. 2 square is 4. The step 2 is multiply given digit numbers which is 2 into 7 and then multiply with 2. So, 7 to 7 is a 14, 14 to the 28 is the multiplication of two digits and then square, 2. So, that answer you write in this place. Note here, this I have left one unit place over here. Leave unit place and write the answer next to it. And add both the numbers, 9, 4 plus 8, 12. And 4, 4 plus 2, 7, 1, 7. So this 27 square is 729. This is our answer. Let us take one more example. 33 square. Now, write first. 3 square is 9. And this 3 square is also 9. Since we are writing square, always you have to write in two digits in the unit place. So, this 3 square is 9 is one digit. We have to make this into two digits. So, I am adding over here 0. Note this point. When there is one square, you will write 0, 1. If it is two square, you will write 0, 4. If it is three square, you will write 0, 9. Note this point. Because whenever it is a squaring in the unit place also you should have two digits. So here I make two, make two digits. I made it here 0, 9. Now next step 2 is plus multiply 3 into 3. 9, 9 into 2 is 18. So add this 18 leaving one place. So 9, 8 and 9 plus 1 is 10. So this is our square of 33. Isn't it easy? So, you will say now, this trick can be applicable for this? Yes. You can use this trick to this also. You will get the same answer. But, whenever you have in the unit place 5, you can say always you can do this trick is faster than this. So, you know, in always in mathematics, there are so many different ways of solving the problems. You can choose whichever one you are comfortable. Right? Other than these two tricks, there is one more trick. Let us write this trick as trick 3. Take a 
देखिए ना एग्जाम्पल फोर्टी सेवन स्क्वेर ऑफ फोर्टी सेवन द नंबर विच इज नियर टू फिफ्टी नंबर हाउ टू गेट द स्क्वेर मोर इजी देन दीज टू ट्रिक्स लेट एस सी हाउ इट इज इन दिस केस की वन नंबर ट्वेंटी फाइव इन युअर माइंड एंड राइट इट असाइड This twenty-five is the fixed number. Keep it in your mind. When the num then see to that number. That number is how much less than fifty here? Three, which is less three for fifty. So I am writing here minus three. Now, how much is the difference? Is there that different square? You are writing here. That is square of three is zero nine. You know you have to write in two digits. Three square is nine. So I am writing here zero nine. Now. Subtract this twenty-five minus three is how much? Twenty-two. So this is our answer. Isn't it easy? Take one more example. Fifty-three square. Here also take first the trick is twenty-five. Keep it aside. Now see here how the more than fifty this number is. How much more? Three. So I will write here plus three. Now write the square of this number. Three is zero nine. And twenty-five plus three is twenty-eight. This is our answer. Isn't it easy? Very simple. If you are seeing any number which is near to fifty, taking forty-six uh, square. So forty-six square. You will take first twenty-five aside. Six is how much is less for fifty? Forty-six is how much? Four is less for fifty. So minus four. Now take the square of four is four four is a Sixteen. Then twenty-five minus four is twenty-one. This is your answer. Isn't it so easy? So now you will say, if this is the trick is there, then what about this trick? Why we are why we are using this? Now this trick is only for those numbers which are near to fifty numbers. When and if you are using this trick for these numbers, that will also work. But now you want to cross check. Let's take forty-six by using by this trick. What is to do? This square and this square. What is the six square is thirty six. Four square is sixteen. Then leave one place and multiply these two. All three numbers, right? Four into four into six, twenty four. Twenty four two is a forty eight. So writing forty eight and adding six. Eight plus three is eleven. Six plus four eleven. One two one one six. See this answer and this answer is same. so you can do this numbers these numbers with this trick also but when it is you are seeing the observe the numbers if their numbers are near by 50 use this trick if the number given number is in the unit place 5 then use this trick more faster if there is any other number other than these types numbers any number if it comes you use this trick now the one question where we will use these squares more in some uh, mathematics chapters mensuration there are so many formulas where you are getting the square of some numbers in the formula there is a square height square radius square all those numbers whenever it comes in the square now you may have a question in your mind when the square comes it comes in decimals suppose radius is 6.5 how will you do points same that time 65 you consider as a 65 normal number and do the sum do you want to see one example let us do one or two example for decimal numbers now if the number is 3.8 square take this number as 38 as trick 2 and write this is 38 square now what is the our trick 8 square This eight square is sixty four. Three square is zero nine. Right? Then three into eight into two. Three eights are twenty four. Twenty four twos are forty eight. So you will add that forty eight. Four eight plus six fourteen. Nine plus one ten. This is also fourteen. So this is our answer. Now when it is comes to decimals, you will write that answer is fourteen point forty four. So square of three point eight square is thirteen point forty four. Isn't it so easy? Take any number. If it is five point six square, 
Now this is near by 50 number. Use that trick. So 25 aside 6 is more. So plus 6. So you will write here 6 is the 36. 25 plus 6 is 31. If they, because this is a decimal, you will do after two digit decimal. Right? I hope you must have understood all these three tricks and you are definitely, you are going to use these all tricks. You take your own numbers and practice this. Whatever comes in your mind, take 65, 25, 35, do this trick. Then take nearby numbers 46, 55, 57, 58, use this trick. Again take any other number, whichever it comes in your mind and use this. All use this trick and see, practice and definitely you are going to save your time and you will speed up your mathematics. I hope you must have understood all these tricks and you are going to use these tricks in your daily mathematics. I will be back with new some more tricks in the next episode.